This video is to demonstrate identification of counterfeit coins with an X-ray spectrometer. We have four double eagles here, and they look pretty good. One looks a little funny. What we're going to do is take an X-ray spectrometer, and we will put it on the first coin and pull the trigger. And we see that one's coming up right at 10% copper, 90% gold. So we know that that one's decent. Nothing wrong with that coin there. So that's our first coin. Now our second coin, we're going to take an x-ray on that. Pull the trigger. Uh-oh. That's not supposed to be there. A genuine U.S. coin would not have that silver tracer in there because the refining capabilities by that point were beyond that. So we know that that one is counterfeit. Next one here is one of the Lebanese counterfeits. And look at that, it's too rich. And the reason is they made so much money selling them as counterfeits that it didn't matter what the gold content was. If it was higher, they didn't care. So they went ahead and did it higher. Now, <clears throat> the other thing you can have happen, you know, this one looks cleaned and polished, looks pretty good for a clean, polished piece. Let's pull the trigger on that one. Uh-oh. That one's way too low. That one's only 18 carat. Now, here's the thing. All these coins weigh the same amount. All of these coins look, at first glance, great. No one would ever expect that to be a cleaned and polished coin. The only one genuine in there is that 1890. From the side, they look great, except for the one that's a little too rich, it's a little more yellow. Weight-wise, They come into spec. So you really want to be careful when you're buying these things to look at the, the details of the coin. But an X-ray spectrometer is incredibly useful for making sure you are not going to have a problem when buying because you can lose a lot of money that way or get a lot in trouble. And uh, that's one of the ways to combat and how I combat uh, buying counterfeit coins and at that rate I'm able to make sure that the coins that are bad get uh, recycled, melted, and destroyed here at Prospector's Golden Gems. My name is David Emsley. Thank you much for watching.